back to the Crimson 15 Podcast. I'm your host, Crimson Sin. If 15 PCA, Nate Tip 454. Be sure to follow us over on Twitter, at C15 Podcast. Join our Discord server, link in the description below. And if you're enjoying the videos, be sure to sub, like, share, and hit that bell for notifications. Another cartoon. It's cartoons. It's the Cartoon Cavalcade. Which is we awesome. have, uh, this was shared on our Discord as well, a Disney Channel. And it's called Amphibia. Amphibia. It looks okay. I, I, the animation's good, which is always a plus. Even if something is, this definitely looks like it's geared towards younger kids. kids. Yeah. Not a lot of, uh, not like the other show where there's like cool action and stuff. But as long as you have consistent animation, I'm gonna at least give you that much. I hate things that look like garbage. <laughs> that's a, that's always a big turnoff for me. Yeah. But um, I'm guessing since Star vs. the Forces of Evil just ended, they're starting to gear up all their other shows. So basically, this girl Anne finds herself in this magical world that's like full of frog people and. She felt like an outsider on you know at home, and now she's here. She's truly an outsider, but everyone's fascinated with her. Oh, what is this? What the, the, the cool? The human. Almost reminds me of Smurfs. Yeah, when I first kind saw of. the first human, the, that guy and his little page friend. Yeah, and has that feeling. And she's just kind of living with these like frog people, and they're super excited, but they're also scared at the same time because they don't know what what her deal is. Yeah. And he's like, oh, you got skinny little arms, a big head. What the hell? Like he's like, what are you? Like he's like excited, but he's scared. But uh, this little frog guy looks really fun. It looks like he's probably going to be the funny character. Yeah. But uh, my only concern is, is it going to just be uh, whatever silly thing they're going to do that day? Like, there's no cohesive storyline? Yeah. I, not not every show has to have a followable arc where you can watch any episode in any order. But I kind of like things. Even Star, even though it started out kind of silly, it actually had a plot that followed through. It got really muddled in the middle, but I think it had a decent ending. This yeah. doesn't look like it's going to have any of that. Do you think you would you rather have it where it's like a story of like, oh, we learn life lessons. So it's like, oh, this episode's about sharing and this episode's kind of about... I think that, that might be it. That yeah. might be what this is. <laughs> where it's Which like, is fine, but I mean, this would be more for like my little nephews would probably love this. Um, another, another question too. Does she go back? To back forth? and forth? Yeah. I she hope, might. I hope she does. Because she looks like she has this magic uh, jewel box or something, like a magic... Uh, well, is it, does it go with her on that side? Yeah. So I'm wondering if it just pulled her in and she's stuck there, or she can go back and forth. I hope she goes back and forth because it would be kind of. Know what I know what I like about this too? It's a it's subtlety in art and animation. Just from her face, you can tell if that's a female character. Yes. Yeah. Even yes, though yeah. she's a child, just from her face because of the eyelash, the way that she taught, the carries herself. Oh, it's a female character. There's none of this like androgynous, weird looking. Oh, yeah, is it man. a boy? Is it a girl? Is yeah, it a... yeah, you know it's a female. But the thing is, also you see the leaf and the the, the stick in her hair. I wonder how long she's been there. Is See, there like a long patch of time between trips? Or, or is it instantaneous? I think she might have fell through a tree or something. Yeah. And maybe. she's got like dust in her hair or whatever. And yeah. she's missing a shoe. And it looks like for most of the clips, she this, looks like this. This might be the first episode. Or maybe she got stuck there and she doesn't have yeah. any clothes. Like, oh boy, she would be, we think she'd be more worried, but that's why I think it's more kid friends. Like, oh, I want to get home. So I was like, you know, the stupid gags, like they don't know what pizza is, but they said, oh, I want it so bad. I don't know what it is. Yeah. So it looks like she's. This could be like her. She seems to be hanging around the same types of characters. Maybe this will become her kind of family, you know, yeah, like her fantasy family. Yeah. But maybe it'll make her appreciate the family she has back on Earth too. Yeah. Exactly. So there's got to be more. And, it can't and, just be silly adventures. And maybe, like I said, maybe season finale, she finds a way to go back and forth. I, like you said earlier, I got, I got a feeling of Doug. Yeah. Uh, Pepper Ann. Pepper Ann. Uh, well, you know, as told by Ginger. Even in the title that she doesn't wear another shoe, so probably she doesn't walk around with just one shoe. I mean, just take it off at that point. I mean, why walk around with one shoe? Yeah, yeah so... That's I, just weird. Yeah, I feel like there's going to be those kind of generated stories of like, oh, friendship, and like, don't tell on your friend. And, yeah, it's going to be like simple. Yeah. See, even something like, uh, you could say that of My Little Pony, yeah. Friendship is Magic. It's, there you go. But they still have a couple episodes that lead into, like, you couldn't watch an episode from season eight, then an episode from season one, because characters changed. Not saying that that it has to be that way, but I kind of expect it now, even in younger shows, to give kids uh, storylines that they can follow. Like they have a brain, basically. Yeah, don't treat like idiots. This isn't um, an edutainment show where it's like, oh, learn your numbers. Those are kids' shows. When someone says, yeah. oh, it's supposed to be for kids, that's what I think of. You know, uh, Ubi Zumi, uh, uh, Paw Patrol, stuff like that. Well, the, Older the, Sesame Street. Yeah. But, you know what's funny, though? Even, um, even shows like that, like uh, my kids watch uh, PJ Masks. The there's later, a storyline. Yeah, there's later episodes. Like, the moth girl ends up having, like, a lunar fortress that would not have happened. In and there's, like, an armadillo one. guy who was, like, another kind of hero, maybe a bad guy. Exactly. So even those kind of stories... But I'm baking 70 30, it's going to be exactly yeah. that. Yeah. That's so, what I'm thinking. I, but I like the, I, the the character designs and the art direction are charming. Mm -hmm. I like yeah. this girl, and she, she looks like she... Uh, 
and on Earth she might not be very confident, but in this world she is because yeah. she's kind of running the show. So maybe she'll grow and grow confidence that way. I, I I like her charm. She seems like a nice young lady, and um, I'll give it a couple episodes. Yeah, I, I her personality kind of sold. Yeah, me. I like her personality. Yeah, she seems really like a, nice. like a nice person. She has I that, like a nice person. She has that go gumshu, but not in a way that annoys you. Yeah, that's the thing yeah. I like about it. Yeah, it, it looks like it could be a winner. Crimson Sin here. Thanks for watching the video. If you're enjoying the content, be sure to sub, like, share, and hit the bell for notifications so you don't miss a single upload. If you have any tips or story ideas, hit us up on Twitter at C15Podcast, or better yet, join our Discord server. Link in the description below.